Hello, and welcome to CPHF Talks. My name is Karen Croker, and I'm a gastroenterologist here at the University of Alberta, and I'm here to talk to you about stool tests. So first of all, in gastroenterology, we order a number of stool tests to help in the diagnosis of many conditions, including infection, inflammation, screening tests, as well as in terms of absorption or nutrition or nutritional status. So today, because there's so many tests, I'm just going to focus on three tests. Fecal calprotectin, which is used in the diagnosis and management of inflammatory bowel disease. Fecal elastase, which is used in the diagnosis of exocrine pancreatic insufficiency as well as the H. pylori stool antigen test. So first of all, I wanna say that nobody really likes to do stool tests. And so that's because you know, I mean stool tests can be embarrassing. You might be a little bit afraid of the results. There, um, sometimes there's just concerns about hygiene or, or um, un the, the, the unknown. And so we have found that when patients do understand what the benefit of the stool test and the result might mean for them, they're more likely to com comply. And so um, I hope that will help you understand. And today we wanna teach you about uh, the, a few stool tests today. Mm -hmm. 